What's going on, guys? Pick up the Cax here. Um, rocking my new shirt. It's uh, it's 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 the OG logo, but inside of uh, the the the, word, the letters, Opti Gaming make up the make up the shirt. So anyway, I just want to sit down and have a little conversation with you guys. One, uh, let's get this out of the way. We're gonna have a, uh, a a weekend challenge, montage making, blah 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 blah. Uh, the code is XP since Call of Duty XP XP since uh. Whatever. Anyway, so the the code is XP. Uh, so get going. They are due um, on Sunday at noon. So leave a video response to this one, and then I'll be uploading them throughout the week. Uh, but I did want to say that that uh, that I had the best experience at Call of Duty XP. It was the best thing ever. Uh, you know, to to top it all off, uh, it's it, it it was such a great great uh, event. But to top it all off, Opti Gaming took home the championship, the million dollar tournament championship. Um, and, uh, and I know there's a lot of you haters saying, no, it wasn't $1 million, it was just fucking 400000 whatever. It could have been fucking $10,000, okay? It doesn't matter. Like, like, being a champion is more than just money. Being the champion is, 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 is a lot, and, and I'm very proud of my teammates, uh, that, that, that did that. And, um, uh, every single one of those people that played on, on the Optic team was in Optic at one point or another. Obviously, uh, three of them are still in Optic, and then Vengeance, um, was part of the first ever Optic Gaming Pro uh, Pro MLG team, uh, so so it was meant to be, I guess, in a way, right? An, an entire team of Optics just uh, just won that. So uh, I'm very proud of you guys, Vengeance, Merc, Big Timer, and my boy Nate Shot. Very very uh, happy for you guys. Um, as soon as I get the trophy from uh, Big Timer, uh, I'll be I'll be making a video uh, showing you guys it. But um, the event was was amazing. It was it was like a like a like a circus meets a concert meets the best event ever. It, it was the best event, hands down, I've ever been to. Next year, when they have Call of Duty XP 2012, I guarantee that if you don't go, you're going to feel like shit. Predator didn't go, and he lived about an hour away. What an idiot. And uh, and, and he regrets it, because I got to play Modern Warfare 3 before anybody else. Uh, well, not anybody else at, at, uh, at there, but I got, I got to play Call of Duty uh, Modern Warfare 3 before a lot of you. And, uh, and, and that's so... Everybody that went got a chance to play it, and it was amazing. The uh, I'm a big fan of the sounds that the guns make, right? So if, if if you guys remember in Call of Duty 2, the sniper rifle had a really deep echo, and it was it was a nice bass. And then Call of Duty in Call of Duty 4, they turned it down a bit, except for the bear. The bear still had a nice echo. Um, Modern Warfare 3, I don't know, but uh, uh, World at War was uh, and, and I don't know for some reason every time I say World at War, I say World at War. Um, but anyway, that game they really fucked the fucked up the sounds in that. And Black Ops Two, it's not as deep and echoey as uh, as Infinity Wards are. But anyway, this particular game, Modern Warfare Three, the Barrett is just so deep. You feel that bass and the boom in your headset. Uh, it was amazing. Um, but but yeah, so. So yeah, it was, it was it was a great thing. Every every time you played, you got like for example on the scrapyard video that you guys saw. At the end of that, I got this badge right here. Okay, so this obviously you put it on and, and, and you can patch it onto your backpack or whatever. Uh, but it was cool. You got badges like you do in game, and they gave you a shitload of them. So it, just just overall, it was an amazing event. Um, I do recommend that next year when they have it, you guys go check it out. Um, but uh, on a lighter note, if you guys ordered a faceplate from me or a canvas or or uh, even the graffiti contest. Um, be happy to know that I've already shipped everything out, and I shipped it out this week. And I feel bad because I've taken such a long time in, in sending shit out. But uh, for the last two months, I've been up to here with with shit that I've had to do for Optic, and uh, it's it's not an easy job. And uh, and I sometimes wish that I can take you one, take some of you into the life of 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 uh, a daily life of me, and, and, and to see what I do from phone calls, from, from three hour phone calls to to following up on, on certain things with the sponsors, etc. But anyway, uh, this is a canvas that I just finished. It's for my boy Nick Ba. Um, I hope he likes it. It's, uh, I don't know, I, I, I think it's coming out. But anyway, this this was being shipped out today. I just finished it fresh off the thing. So, so yeah, this I've been talking for, for quite a lot now. But uh, I'm going to be having a video on, uh, on Optic Nation, which, uh, which is going to talk about Rambo going, uh, you know, no longer being a part of Optic's uh, professional team. Um... You know more on my experience at Codex Speed, the people that I talked to, and uh, I'm going to be giving away a Codex Speed T-shirt. I know a lot of you didn't get a chance to buy them, and I don't think they sell them anywhere. I think that the only place they sold them were there. Um, was there, but uh, but yeah. Until next time, guys. This has been Cax. I'm out. Peace.
Also, don't forget that if you're going to be participating in the Sniper Challenge, uh, the montages or daytages are due on Sunday at noon. Just leave a video response to this one. I'm going to leave a video response at noon on this video as well. Any submissions that are that are posted there after my 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 uh my submission are not going to be uh, taken into consideration, but I will be posting them throughout the week, and I am going to look at every single one like I always do, and uh, I'm going to pick the, the best of the best. So, uh, no, you don't have to have a PVR, uh, but I, I do request and, and do suggest that you do that you do a good job. You know, it's um, it's potentially you know your chance to get a couple of more subs into your channel and for people to become fans of your, of your work on your way to become the next YouTube sensation. Anyway, um, but yeah, guys, until next time, this has been off the Cox. I'm out. Peace.